Welcome, welcome. Yay. Catherine and I were nominated by Kids Wild Ride. We will put a link to their uh, video in our description. The Kids, Kids Wild Ride nominated us to do the $10 challenge. Yes, we have done the $10 challenge already, but this is going to be the, uh, the mass toy collab $10 challenge. And Catherine and I did this one as a team. And let me tell you, it was difficult. Yeah, because mom wants everything I don't want and I want everything mom doesn't want. <laughs> That's right. We had a really hard time picking out things. But we finally did. And we actually went we went shopping at the Dollar Tree. We went shopping at the Goodwill. And we went to Walmart. Walmart. And we finally settled on some things. And we had a really good time. Even though we argued a bit, we still had a good time. And we we yes. saw so many things that were like, oh, this is really on sale, so oh, I want to get want this. It, we and, want it, we want it, we want it. Yeah, we and we were so good, and we didn't do it. So, but we'll probably go next weekend. <laughs> the only one we were for sure getting was that one that we got. <laughs> the one that we got. Yeah, well, we did. It was part of the thing. Anyway, so let me get started. I'm going to show you everything that we got. So first I'm going to show you the thing we got from Dollar Tree. Catherine found this. It's it's an 8 pack of dough. I got it one time. It's tiny things and these are the brights and neon pack. I got one one We're time. going to take out one or two and uh, show them. We were going to play with them but we're kind of running low on time for the mm -hmm. evening. So we'll see, we'll see. We might make something really small with it. The other thing we got at the Dollar Tree was this book. It's a Hello Kitty book. This is another kind of book, like the kind Mama used to get, where you simply paint with water. There's no paint in there. You just you put water on and paint the page with a paintbrush and water. Very simple, very easy. Very right, gives you something to do. Next, I'm going to Walmart. These are things we got that only cost a dollar also. We got some One Direction. We found another, another one. This one is a different shape. Catherine's going to do another Liam. Niall. Niall. I'm sorry. Every, why do I always think it's Liam? I don't know. Anyway, so this is a dog like tag. And you, you, um, you decorate it. You put the sticker on who you want. It gives you all of them. So just in case you worry that you might not get the one you want, that's not how it works. You'll get all of them. You get all of them in the sticker to put on there. I didn't realize that at first. Neither did I, and I was going to scream if Mom got an aisle only, <laughs> and I didn't. And this was the other thing we got. It's a little Angry Bird Star War Wars. <laughs> <laughs> dog tag fun pack look for special gold dog tag and now for the massive surprise that we found at Goodwill let that me tell I almost you almost gave away at Goodwill they um they have a whole lot of toys there right now that they got from Target they told me so I don't know if you guys have Goodwills but maybe you might want to go check they had the Olaf plush that comes apart for four dollars. They had V and Va dolls for six dollars each. Mm -hmm. They had also the corresponding uh, uh, packs of clothes that go with the V and Va dolls, the fashion packs, for three dollars each. They had a Lego uh, movie, Lego movie, um, Lego set. Mm -hmm. Lego movie <laughs> it was Lego. Like, it was for four dollars or three dollars or something like that. And then they had some Star Wars games and some others they had some other things yeah it was it was pretty cool some art packs and things to do and it was very cheap and I'm thinking oh Christmas Christmas <laughs> why did we come here I want everything I would have bought all of it if we were not doing this challenge but I think what we got it was it's the good. best deal because yeah. this is so expensive usually and it's the biggest reason why we don't have this more of <laughs> this Ta-da! 
Boom! Five dollars. Look at the price tag. Five dollars. A two pack of Minecraft figures. These things go for like 20 bucks at, at Target. I could not believe this. I was, you can ask Catherine, I was, I picked this one up and it did not go down. It was, it was between this and the dolls at one point, but I never took this out of my hands. It's like once I grabbed it, it was like in there. <laughs> at first, I thought I wanted the dolls more, but then I looked closer at this and part and I really wanted that one. So, that is what we got from our $10 challenge. Mm -hmm. All right, so instead of tagging people, because most people have already done this that we know, and I don't want to tag anybody else, I'm just going to add some, either some cards or links in my description to some of the $10 challenge videos that I've watched that I really liked and I thought really good um, and the ones that Catherine's liked mm -hmm. and we'll put some of those in our description so that if you watch the video and you think it's really neat then you can go see some other neat ones because everybody's is different it's amazing what you can get with $10 um, and also I will just challenge anyone who wants to do this challenge to do it it's it's, a, it's really fun and um, you can learn quite a bit about budgeting and making a decision sometimes that it's not always easy to make, you know, when you only have a certain amount of money to spend. Yeah. So, let's get into this. Do that then pay. Yeah. Okay. okay. So, now let's open them up. Alright. Oh, wait. Gonna open these up here first. going to do the One Direction. I guess while you do One Direction, put it together. Mm -hmm. I might open this thing up. Okay. Alright, let's see who I got. Stuck in the bag. Oh. Whoa, Gabby. It was like, uh -oh. there was a piece stuck in the bag. Is the charm supposed to be like that? I don't remember. Yeah. Like that yeah, so you put it on. But. Okay, so let's see who I got here. These things don't tell you who they are. They just have numbers. So. Did you get a sticker? I did. Oh, I did. I got another, um, Hey, I know what these are called. <laughs> what? They're stormtroopers. <laughs> I got a stormtrooper. Is this? This looks kind of like it might be Anakin and Obi Wan Kenobi. Uh, not Obi Wan. Ardu. Ardu. R T R three C P O. I think is what it's called. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Those the stickers. Let's see. Um, and I think that, I think I may have gotten Anakin, but I'm not really sure who this is supposed to be. But it is the Little Red Angry Bird. It's pretty cool. It is, um, number 14 of 24. It's pretty cool. Okay, so... Then I put, I put, night, night, now you're on the front, and Harry on the, the back. Harry? Yeah. Is he your second favorite? No. Whoa. But I already, but I already had one with my two favorites, so. Well, who's your uh, second favorite? Uh, Zane. Cool. Can I try to open mine up? Like, take it out of the box? Yeah. They don't look like they're going to be that hard. Let's show them oh, both up close real quick first. Okay. I'm showing you. Yeah. <laughs> what is up with the lights in here? Everything's showing everything. I don't know. I've got too much glare going on. Probably something hey, I need to fix. So. Mom will do that for me. You were doing it right. This is Steve well, and the horse with the apple. It. And what else is that in there? Haystack. Oh, uh, hey, Zach, I thought that was something else. Well, duh, Mommy. Well, let's see what we got in here. We got a skeleton. You got a wither, I think. There's a lot of stuff talking about him on the back of this box. Cool. Okay, that's good. Cause that's good for me. You know everything in here. I don't know all. I might know them. I know them, but I don't know if I know the names. Look how look easy how, this is. Yeah, like, look. You to say that yeah, look how easy this come out. And then these come out. Just come out. 
Easy, easy. Easy, easy. This is the little bow. And it's a little tiny part here. Does not, it bends a little, but you gotta put quite a lot of pressure on it for such a small little piece. This apple is like yeah. solid. It's so solid. Oh, Did you hear it? You. <laughs> I was trying to see one. if you could hear it. I'm gonna drop it. So here's the horse. Let me cover it, Catherine. Horse has a tail. Horse head moves. Do do do. Legs move. Legs have bent joints or jointed. Whoa, that's crazy. Does this? I think. Does this come off? No. Yeah? No, it doesn't. Okay. It doesn't. It doesn't. This comes off. The saddle. Steve's saddle comes off. He's got his tail. Even his tail moves. So he's a nice little horse. He's his a tame horse. Saddle. I'll saddle you him. Give me Steve and the haystack. Hey, here. I'm going to take the apple. Wait, Come show them the apple in his hand. Okay. I'm going to give him Apple goes in his hand. Catherine wants to show him. This does come off. I was moving his nose and it came off. Okay. So the, the uh, bridle comes off. Yes. Ta -da! You just have to push it on tight. So okay. Deep. Sorry. I'm kind of playing with the camera. <laughs> Trying to figure out if it would focus in or not. Okay. So. I'm gonna play around I'm gonna with my mine like this. I got uh, does yours have the stuff on the back too? Like mine? Probably. It does. It talks about it. So this is the skeleton. It says his type is hostile mob. So his his head his head doesn't seem yeah okay his head moves side to side but not with his arms up. His arms move. Legs move. And oh, his body moves too, so he can be different shapes. All right, and then we have a creeper. I'll read it out after I finish showing you. Creeper's got ah oh, four movie little leggies, jointed legs. That's cool. And its head turns side to side. And then we have an Enderman. Don't look in his eyes. Enderman's coming for you. <laughs> he's gonna attack you if you look in his eyes. So he's all like, don't look at the camera. This is how they. This is how they always look to me. Yeah. See, he's coming. Here he comes. Ooh. <laughs> and then I go. <laughs> so okay, yeah. His head moves. Arms and legs move. Here, and this is the zombie. And uh, he moves. Head moves. His waist. Move side to side, his legs move, arms move. He can hold the sword, there's a place on both hands for the sword to go. And he's coming at you. He's gonna get you. Cool! So that's all the Minecraft. And look at all these little figures. I got. really like this. <laughs> it's almost like a dollar piece, sort of. I'm gonna be playing it's with really these cool. later someday. Sometime tomorrow. Okay. okay, give me, just give me one. Give me one. Here. Mommy's being impatient. Give me one. Give me one. Uh, <laughs> I'm getting the screen. I'm getting the green. Oh, wait, wait. Did you just uh, say I'm getting the screen? No, I'm oh, getting wow, the green. Oh, wow, this comes out real easy. It just came right out. Yeah, and even after you oh, play man, with it, it this is easy. This is awesome. This is really cool. Whoa, this is very malleable. I used to make cupcakes out it of these. It's not hard. The last time I got Play-Doh... At the Dollar Tree was a long time ago and it was hard. But it Catherine's got, been getting played over. It got a hard. Yeah, it got hard. Because really I because I had it for a long time. So watch this. Watch how easy these come out. Like I'm pushing it in like a lot, and then if you squeeze the edges just a little bit, you're gonna watch the end and boom, it just falls out. And then you just can you can do this, and then you press down. It's a heart. Okay, this isn't perfect, and I didn't finish it really well. This is called a very impromptu rose that I made. What do you think of my plate? My dough rose. 
Go, <laughs> <Little> Catherine. <laughs> cool. Okay, so I made this heart. It's like candy. Okay. Then I made the snake. That's the beautiful, the most beautiful snake I've ever seen. Oh my god. <laughs> and then I made a cupcake. Oh my goodness. This this took. Look how look at how creative Catherine is. This took some talent. I mean, this is like grade A plus plus. All I did with the green was push <laughs> it in here. I know. And it and it came out perfect. I used to do that with the big ones. Okay. Now we're gonna do the the, the painting. And painting has to be quick. We'll try to talk while we do it. We're both gonna pick a page. It might have to be fast forwarded though. Well, we can, but we we gotta be. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll do that. But we might. We, I say we, but really it's I. I will maybe do that. Alright, now we've got everything out to do a page from the book. Well, we didn't even show them the book. We just took pages out, did we? You showed the front of the book, so. Yeah, okay. So the pages are like these. This is the one that I'm going to paint. You paint the places that are patterned. If there's not a pattern, then you don't paint that place. Now you can. The water is going to create paint, and you could if you wanted, you know, to mix. It's okay to get out the lines and everything. Here you go. This is what I have. That pretty one, cute one. Because I really love that. So here. we'll probably paint, and then I, this part probably will be fast forwarded from this point on. Go! At first, I didn't realize that it was going to keep the pattern. Well, it That's doesn't always, that. like, um, if you paint on a lot and you're not using quite as much water and you, you can kind of, or you use water, but you can kind of get it off, but it'll keep it mostly, yeah. yeah. Once you get to, you're not supposed to put a lot of water on it, it's actually a bit more fun, huh? That's what I mean, it makes it where you can use, well, you can use the paint, that's what I was saying. You yeah, kind of mix like. the paint on the brush and then you can actually paint yeah. some of it without like using Like you just water. use a little tiny bit of water and you just go all over it. Yeah. And then you just kind of paint all over wherever you want to paint. First I thought it wasn't working when I, that's why I was adding so I was like, come on, go yeah. away, and go that away. Makes, what happens to paint when you add more water? It gets less, it gets thinner and thinner and thinner. Sorry. And it it's the worst. We finished our things. I'm going to show you what we did really quick and then we're going to sing our goodbye song. Catherine's now painting her uh, paint paper. <laughs> With water. Why? This is our paint. I love you too. Aww. So this is the one Catherine did. It is extremely wet. But it's so very cute. That's what she did. Okay, I'm going to put it down before it drips on something else. Okay. And here is the one that I did. Ta -da. Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. Yay! We actually had a lot of fun. So this is everything that we got, and I'm super pleased with it. So I'm super pleased. Thank with you, water that. thank you, thank you, Kids Wild Ride, for tagging us, even though we've been tagged already, but you didn't know. <laughs> By the way, everybody should go check out Kids Wild Ride. They are awesome, awesome. They're what mommy calls bossom sauce. Not just bossom? The bossom sauce. Okay. Okay. Are we ready? Yeah. Like, like subscribe, subscribe, and comment down below. If you like our show, then you know where to go.